Hey guys, so today I'm going to do my rolling project 10 pan update. I have down below all the items I have previously used and or hit pan on and the item that I have previously decluttered and the items I'm working on. So I wanted to share with you guys the two items that I have finished up over this past month. I'm adding two new items for my rolling project 10 pan, get it? And I'll share with you guys progress on the rest of the items going forward. So I used up the little Chloe fragrance. This smelled okay. Wasn't my favorite. Glad it's gone, but I used that up. Not much to say about it. Used up the YSL Rouge Villep Shine and Purple and Contouchable. I had randomly selected this for this project. I did not throw this in. Higher powers were involved, but I have finished this completely. Really happy to be done with it. And yeah, I am done with that lipstick. So those are the two items that are out. I think I have 8 out of 10 now for this project. So hopefully next update will be the conclusion next month. The two items I randomly have selected to add to this project pan is another nail polish. This is the China Glaze in Riveting. And it's kind of like an orangey red with some yellow gold flex into it. So that is what has been added. Perfect for October. And then the other thing was the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Face Primer Dewy. And I really like this stuff. I've been wearing it lately. This is actually the primer I have on underneath my Urban Decay Naked Skin Foundation. And I do like it. And I'll continue to use it and hopefully be done with this for this project. So going into the items that I'm still working on. Still working on the Tarte Shape Tape. This is in the shade Light Neutral. I believe I'm kind of down to here. When I take the applicator out and look in the light, it looks like it's darker, like right about here. So still use it. I just use kind of a dab on the back of my hand every day for underneath my eyes, around my nose, on my chin, any blemishes, but I do really like this stuff takes a while to use which is good but yeah don't first see me using this anytime soon first see me using it up that's what I meant then I have the Anastasia Beverly Hills Nicole Guerrero the highlight and glow glitter which is this gold shade right there still no paint on it I do use it on occasion it's also really pretty for all over the lid a couple other highlights the wet and wild mega glow highlighting palette and I pulled what are these shades called? Sweet Peony and Diamond Lily, which are these two shades up here, the Sweet Peony and the Diamond Lily. I actually have both of those highlights on today as my highlight. I have the Pink Peony or Sweet Peony on more with a little bit of the blue to top it just to kind of blend everything in, but that is the look today. Still no paint on those. I have my First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream. This is a really thick, nice cream. I love it more for the winter time, but I have used it a couple more times this past month. So still a whole lot to use. There is six ounces in here. And I believe it was brand new when I pulled it for this project. So pretty good progress. The other two nail polishy kind of things that were previously in it. Simple Colors Ruby Ruby. This is a true red and didn't reach for it. I really haven't painted my nails. I need to. I need to just sacrifice some sleep and paint my nails. And then this is the Orly Epics Flexible Seal Coat to top it off. And then the last thing is from Poetic Blend. This is the Ghost Oil, and it was actually in my travel bag this whole month. I just found it for this update, and yeah, it was lost for a month, so hopefully I can reach for that a little bit more. But that is the items I've used up, the items I'm still working on, and the new items for this Rolling Project 10 pan. Let me know what you think is the next item that I will be using up from this project. Hopefully I can finish it by next update. We'll see. That's two items, and these are a lot of highlighters, concealers, nail polishes, so we'll see what happens. But thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe for more videos, and I'll talk to you in my next one. Bye.